Hello everyone, let's start by creating a new render texture. I will set the size for it to 20, 80 and 11 and 70. Then let's assign the new render texture to the main camera's output. Then let's create a new only shader graph. Then let's create a new material with that shader. Let's open the shader. Create a new texture 2D property that will be using the render texture we already have made. Then create a new gradient property. You cannot change this in the material. Let's connect the Texture 2D node to a Sample Texture node. Then connect the Gradient to a Sample Gradient node. Now connect the Sample Texture 2D's RGBA output to Sample Gradient's Time input. Next, I will assign the render texture as the texture. Next, I will change the gradient. I will also change the mode from blend to fixed. Now I can change the colors. Now, as you can see, in the sample gradients preview, the gradient changes the render texture's colors to the nearest gradient in the gradient. Now, let's connect the sample gradient's output to Unlit Master's input. And then let's save. I will assign the shader's material to a UI image. Then let's set the material's texture 2D to the render texture. Then te let's test it out. And as you can see, it looks good. But what if I wanted to have color with this? So back in the shader editor. We shall make a new multiply node and assign the sample textures RGBA output to multiply A input. And then assign sample. Then let's connect sample gradients output to multiply B input and then connect multiply output to unlit master's color input. Then let's save it and go back to Unity. And as you can see, there is color and there is still the same shading method which it used earlier. So, thank you for watching this video. If you found this helpful, please give it a like and subscribe for more content like this. I'm sorry that I haven't been able to upload in some time. I just haven't had any idea what I should upload, so give some ideas in the comments. Bye.